That's insane. Bro. Don't reach over here, you fucking bloated <laughs> Italian. Dude. You look like an Italian dude that drowned and then just still lived. <laughs> You How about a zombie? Fuck. Yeah, you fucking look like a, a like Sicilian zombie, zombie, dude. Bro. So you're not going to influence Indian children, dude. I don't think a lot of Indian kids look at you and be like, I want to fucking, you know, look like a French Paul Bunyan when I get older. You know what I'm saying? French Paul Bunyan. Yeah, dude, you look like fucking... Why am I, why am I French? <laughs> dude, you look like Paul Bunyan if he just drank champagne all day and never did uh, any forestry. That's what you look like, bro. I don't oh. think he's going to solve, you know, fucking the... AIDS crisis or anything yeah. like that. Not that there's a crisis, but I don't, <laughs> dude, I, there is a crisis, bro. <laughs> not with AIDS, not anymore. Bro, look at him, dude. What do you have? <laughs> I don't know. What have. Bro, it's not why AIDS. does he have to have some? Because he's I, Korean. I, have to be, well, I don't know, dude. That's fucking racist, racist sugar bro. And no, I got a cousin that always got that got stung by a bunch of bees one time on a picnic, and y'all look similar. <laughs> God damn it! Fine. If he still wants to call someone else names, that's you know we're in a, we're adults. Really, we're in our thirties. And that's not even a haircut that you got. You, you look like one of the untouchables. <laughs> <laughs> this guy want to make fun of my haircut. We going to see. That's not, a that's not a haircut. That's all you got left, bro. <laughs> Woo! That no, shit is slick. CBS no, wants to know. No thoughts. Chris, you look like a deaf guy that goes to the gym. <laughs> you look like, dude. 100%. Oh, you're easier to hate, I well, think. What, well, you think? I mean, there's just more. I mean, not in like a, if I know you know. But if I'd have seen you, dude, walking by, yeah, dude. More, more than you? <laughs> oh, dude. Bro, I'm like, who's this? Bro, you look like a mechanic from Nordstrom Rack, dude. <laughs> That's the fucking problem, dude. <laughs> You're like, damn, I didn't know uh, Nordstrom Rack did tires, you know? <laughs> Uh, Tony Hinchcliffe not happy either. Dude, Tony Hinchcliffe, bro, put on some weight, dude. You can't weigh nine pounds and compete <laughs> at a heavy weight. Okay? <laughs> Tony Hinchcliffe looks like a um he looks like a uh he looks like he's been just run solely on bone marrow, man. <laughs> you look like you don't even have a skeleton. <laughs> It's just bone marrow that's just kind of jellyfish? holding on to each other. Yeah, it's like a, like yeah, dude. A jellyfish. He looks like a strong jellyfish, and that's all he looks like. Calm and enter promo code church. That's right. That's. Go to helixsleep.com slash Joey. I'm doing good. Can you guys believe it? I, I like this is the best I've ever done. I'm real happy. Go to helixsleep.com slash Joey and get fifty dollars off of your order. That's helixsleep.com slash You fucking you're reading like the smartest brother in junior high. <laughs> Oh, you look like a Persian dude on Test 200 that's staring straight into the sun. You can't even open your fucking eyes, dude. Dude, you're out of your you, mind. I'm about to put quarters in your face, bro. And dude. play your ass. <laughs> play your ass. What? Dude, I play uh, ping pong at her spot. Ping pong is also it's the number one white power sport. <laughs> Probably. Look at that. Oh, my God. Dude, it looks like a 50-year-old things... dude's ass on her chest. <laughs> Get some oh. pants for your tits. Can you see this lady's tits, bro? I want to thank everybody from F Fighter and the Kid. You know, I was a, and that's a, a podcast where they have this man who is a fighter, and he got he got beat up and he got attacked a couple times and he couldn't fight anymore because his brain couldn't handle it. He was on the brisk of freaking getting that, you know, a brush with that tism, and so his brain, you know, told him. We got to shut it down. And so he quit fighting and he met up with this other man who's kind of aging, but he's, this, you know, a sweet, funny guy and he got strong legs, the other guy. And their names are Brendan and Brian and the podcast is called The Fighter and the Kid. And one of them uses moisturizer. And one of them needs moisturizer. Yeah, I have yeah, terrible, I have, ter I have bad skin. skin. Dude, you look like, a, you, you're like the dude who, if everybody was escaping prison, you'd be like, nah, I got to... I got to be up in the morning for breakfast. You know what I'm saying? Like, you'd be the dude that's like, doesn't get that everybody's fucking getting out, you know? Bro. Okay, bro. guy. Oh, okay. Have fun in here. Okay, yeah. We're just... uh, you look Dutch, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you looked at yourself. Yo, well, you know what? what you fuck look fuck aerodynamic. Bro, no well, Dutch is sh the fucking shit. Yeah. Apple pie, the, the shoes. Dutch. Everybody, dude. Two Holland, things. Heineken. Yeah, three Holland, things. I think yeah. and it's Frank. all Dutch. All right, listen. All right. Uh, we got. There was a lot of rumors in my town that I beat down syndrome. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, that's inspiring, man. <laughs> that's how I felt when I heard him, because I didn't start him. <laughs> <laughs>